A rural town in Vermont that's a popular peak foliage photo ops for influencers is now closing its doors to non-residents for the second year in a row. Each autumn for the past five years, Pomfret, a town of only 900 residents, has been flooded with influencers and photo enthusiasts who are eager to pose with the state's stunning foliage, leading to traffic jams and trespassing in locals' private property. This road is a gravel and dirt road that is not maintained for the level of traffic that it gets. Remember that Vermont has had disastrous flooding, which makes care of these gravel roads worse. On one single lane winding path called Cladland Road, a resident told Fortune he'd see, quote, lines of cars pulled over to the side of the road, dozens long, 20, 30, 40 cars per row. The town took action last year by closing Cloudland Road to non-locals and raising $22,000 to hire patrols during busy hours to only allow locals to pass through. This year, the road will close again, starting September 25th to address resident safety concerns. Beth Van Laysen of Woodstock Chamber of Commerce told Fortune, quote, It's a very small one-lane dirt road. If there are two cars parked on it, an ambulance or fire truck wouldn't be able to get through. And Vermont isn't alone. Since the pandemic, influencer-driven tourism is booming worldwide, from quaint cafes to iconic landmarks. Affordable flights have made travel more accessible for people who prioritize experiences over luxury purchases. Plus, the influencer marketing industry is expected to reach $24 billion this year, with content creators adding to never-ending bucket lists. Other popular destinations in Italy and Spain have considered stricter regulations and additional visitation fees to combat over-tourism. While places like Pomfret and surrounding towns depend on tourism for income, select board chair Benjamin Brickner notes safety has to come first. He hopes the road closure will be temporary, allowing the town to return to its peaceful rural roots as the initial surge of interest fades.